Hi, it's me again with Corel Raw Tips and Tricks. Somebody sent me this photograph and asked how you would draw that. It's really easy. Once you've got your checkerboard pattern drawn, and I drew it pretty uh, tight and small, and then you could put it in any shape you wanted. I would suggest making the um, item quite a bit bigger than your shape. So we've got a circle. Just make sure it'll fall fit. We've got a circle, and then we have a just another shape I kind of mimicked. So I need to make it a little bit bigger. Kind of, I think it kind of helps Corel put it in there. Now, to do this, we need three of these. So we're going to change our nudge factor to 30 inches. I'm really big. And we're going to make three. I just control D and then move it over. Control D and move it over. Control D. So we've got our shape. <clears throat> You've got one selected. Go up to effects and envelope. You don't have to do any settings, but go right here, create from envelope form. And then you get a little arrow and it tells you that you want that form. Click on this one, envelope from form. Click on the third one, envelope from form. Pretty cool designs. Um, there's a lot, you know, you know, this, I have a little curve to it. This one is straight lines. You don't have to, um, you know, do any particular shape. Um, matter of fact, let's take this note away. And now we have more like in the, I think the picture they sent me, except for it's upside down. And then just click on your item. Go right here to create envelope, envelope form, and voila, you have it. Now, if you want a border around it, I would just select these and go CE. As a matter of fact, I would probably take this and make a black border first, make it whatever thickness you want. And then if you want it in there, EC or CE, doesn't matter what order you put it in, but that'll give you a border around it. Now you could probably still check the border and make it, you know, even thicker still. Now you could put color behind that. I don't have any color where the white is. So we could take this and make it blue and then put it over there and go up to object order, back a page, and you have a completely different look. Blue doesn't really make it stand out, but if we grab the blue and make it yellow, I mean, look at that. Anyway, I hope that answered their question, and thank you for watching.